fuck Mika Brzezinski, fuck Joe Scarborough, cuck Joe, fuck Zygmunt Brzezinski, Kissinger, uh, MSNBC, Joy Reid, Don Lemon, Fox News, the, fuck them all. And again, fuck you. If you're more concerned with the word fuck, then you are getting fucked over by your elites. You're not one of us. You're not one. It hasn't clicked yet. It hasn't dawned on you. And it's getting so bad now. We're at such a late hour. If it hasn't dawned on you yet, I'm not sure it ever will. I'm not sure what else you, more you need to see. Honestly, what, 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 what more do you need to see? What, what more needs to happen? Somebody t- drop it in the comments. Again, what would need to happen for you to go, motherfuckers, what would they need to do? They throw a bunch of January 6th protesters in the gulags for, for demonstration, really. A, a rowdy demonstration, and that's what it was. Anything, anybody says anything different, I know you've never been involved in protests. You certainly don't understand what took place there during the Civil Rights Movement or with the Black Panthers or anything like that. So I, you, you're just corny, probably, it, it, or you're a liar. Okay, Rowdy protests, they throw a bunch of January 6th protesters in the gulags. Ray Epps, who nobody can answer whether or not he was actually working on behalf of any federal agency, Ray Epps, in the last couple of days, gets a year of probation and a fine, and he's on camera eight times across the January 6th footage saying we're going into the Capitol? Donald Trump gets 91 indictments, 7,000 years of prison hanging over his head, taking him off the ballot. Ray Epps says, we're going into the Capitol. Make sure you understand, we have to go in the Capitol. Even moments before the, 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 you know, the barricades were broken, he's seen leaning into somebody, leaning, leaning and saying into somebody's ear something that probably was, we're, we got to get in the Capitol. He gets a pass, and they want you to believe that this guy was just a dummy? Now the, 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 the neocon, neoliberal machine, the MSNBCs are trying to sell the story that Ray Epps was just some idiot who listened to Donald Trump, who believed Donald Trump. <laughs> now they're going to use their own federal agents and excuse their behavior, their own behavior, their own role in the deal by saying, no, these people are just dumb enough to believe Donald Trump. Ray Epps was a fucking fed. He moved like a fed. His behavior was, was, and if he wasn't a Fed, sure as hell could have fooled me. And I know a lot of people feel the same way. And why can't, why can't the intelligence community tell us that this man was not working for a federal agency? Why can't the intelligence community, why can't the, the police state, motherfuckers, conservatives, why can't the police state tell us how many federal agents were in attendance, in the crowd, on the day in question uh, when, this, when this incident broke out of January 6th. Why can't they tell us? Why can't they answer with a straight face? Well, it's a security issue. It always comes back to the same thing. It's what Edward Snowden said. You know, they, they make it illegal to find the information you need to prove that there's corruption. And you people are still worried about the word fuck. Well, fucky, fuck, fuck. Tell me what set of circumstances would prove worthy for you to use profanity? None. 